Hey Jules Bless Vegan and as always welcome to my channel and for those who are new I hope you can benefit. So I'm on day 6,232 of a urinary tract infection. <laughs> Even if it's not true it feels like it and I am surrendering meaning I've just been doing an over-the-counter and it is not helping. I'm in crazy pain. I just have that electricity shooting out of my fingertips. I can't even think at school. So I'm surrendering. I'm going to drive myself to Kaiser and just say, hey, fix it. And the thing is, they'll want to give me antibiotics. And that's distressing because I'm always working on my microbiome. But at the same time, I used to not work on that at all. So at least I'm going to be inputting good things and it will recover much quicker. The other thing is, because I've had kidney disease, I can't really mess around too much. You know, I'm not allowed to take NSAIDs, which are things like aspirin and um, even, uh, oh, how funny, I can't even think because people take it every minute. Motrin, right? I can't take any of those things. I can kind of do Tylenol, but I don't know if that'll be specific, you know, to this area of my body. I'm going to go. I'm going to go and let the doctors do their job. So my challenge for you is to let me know when have you tried to fix something and in fixing it, when it barely started to seem better, you stopped the protocol. That's kind of me. I mean, the ASA was seemingly working. And then last night I decided not to take it because I decided I was well. And by last recess, I was losing my mind. I probably should have stayed the course so that I wouldn't thaw. I kind of refer to it as thawing. Another time I can think of that is like, um, I would get acid reflux really bad. So I would get off of the fried foods and stuff for a couple of days till it subsided. And then somehow I would slip a brain cell and forget how awful it was until I was drowning and choking in my sleep and having acid come out my nose. And then I'd go, oh yeah, <laughs> I probably should have stayed off of that. So it's the same thing with this new way of eating. And certainly the example of this urinary tract infection, I need to stay the course. So how about you? When have you slipped a brain cell and stopped doing what was supposedly fixing it the minute you started feeling better? I'd love to hear in the comments below. Like if you like, join us if you haven't. And until we talk again, prayers for me and know that you're blessed.